We're back with a recipe that is perfect for Halloween. You know me and yep. my holiday recipes. I love a holiday recipe, and this is a fun one. And I think you said your daughter is going to oh, like she's obsessed this. with pizza, so and we're going to bring it home, I think. Kind of kids in the kitchen-ish, right? Mm, yeah. I'm getting you involved, too. Exactly. So I'm excited. Be, yes, we're making mummy pizzas today. This is great for Halloween night and so, so easy to do. So I think... You can do this, right? Yeah, totally. <laughs> so, even me. Even you. No. So um, what we are actually going to start with is going to be, these are sandwich thins. So you can use this as the base of your pizza. Just um, so they're individual. You know, okay. you each make your own. So these are sandwich thins. They look just like this when you purchase them. It's kind of like a thin crust pizza. Okay. Love it. My other fancy item that I love is also the squeezable pizza sauce because if you have ever um, opened a can of pizza sauce before, it just sits in your refrigerator. Mm -hmm. It kind of probably goes bad. You can keep this in your refrigerator for quite some time. Squeezable pizza sauce, love that for sure. Mm -hmm. We are gonna spread our sauce just right on to the pizza crust. And then we get to decorate it just like you would any pizza. What would your daughter choose? Pepperoni. Pepperoni. She's a pepperoni girl. Definitely. I'm going to let you uh, get the pepperoni. Okay. So you can dive on in with some pepperoni. I'm going to use some pre-cooked turkey sausage crumbles on mine. Just a very, um, you know, make it, make it your own. Mm. So you're going pepperoni. I'm going turkey sausage. And then here comes the, the fun, mm -hmm. right? So string cheese is meant to be pulled, right? Yeah. So we are going to pull our string cheese and we're gonna kinda crisscross our string cheese. This is where kids can get involved. There is no rhyme or reason. This is uh, pizza crafting at its finest. So you're just gonna pull your, your string cheese, make it look like it's a, a pizza mummy all wrapped up. I'm gonna go a couple more, more pulls here. Um, and then, kids may frown on this, but you gotta have some eyeballs. So we're <laughs> gonna take a couple olives here and we're gonna put those on the pizza as well. And um, honestly, everything in here is pre-cooked. And so you can, are yours gonna be a one-eyed monster? We could do a one-eyed monster. Let's do it. No. <laughs> we'll do two. <laughs> we won't be so scary. Um, but everything on here is pre-cooked. So really it just needs to warm up. Okay. Usually about five to seven minutes in the oven. And we've got some in the oven right now. I'm gonna pull out. Oh yeah, getting melty. Getting all nice and melty. And I'm gonna add them over here to our plate. And this is Halloween dinner ready to go. Yeah. So fun. The kids love it because they get to decorate their own. Add some, mm -hmm. um, add some peppers or mushrooms or anything that they want if they want that. Exactly. Um, and it just really makes for a super fun, easy, Halloween recipe. Yeah. Might actually get them to eat those olives. Exactly. There. <laughs> if you eat eyeballs, right? It's exactly. all good. Yeah. Well, that is just so neat for Halloween. Katie George, Hy-Vee Dietitian, thank you so much for you joining betcha. us. We'll be right back.